good day designer welcome back to my channel hope you guys is doing great this evening today i want to show you how to make a church logo on your android smartphone exactly like this now you can present it on a mock-up without importing any mock-up using photopea kindly watch and learn the new tricks on how you can achieve this you don't need to download any mock-up just open a mock-up i mean photopea website and run things like this thanks please consider subscribing to our youtube channel and click the bell to be notified when we post new videos without wasting much of our time let's start with today's tutorial Pick up graphic skills with creativity. Good egg designer, welcome back to my channel once again. So as I saw that, I will show you how to make a simple charge logo on your Android smartphone using PC Lab. So without wasting much of our time, let's determine our size. So the size I'm going to use is 1267 by one to it zero. So this is the size as you can see so after the time of our size the next thing to do we are i'm going to as well show you how you can mock up this particular this i mean logo so go to the shapes after getting to the shape then you select this run shape then your opacity reduce it to zero and come to stroke increase it to 26 increase it to 26 as you can see or 20 let's say 20 so after that use the relative position to position it to the center then go to the shapes again then after getting to the shapes then you crop it exactly like this but you can check the size let it be size b79 so which is uh you see six fifty seven so it's actually okay like this then you center it as well now you can actually copy this then after copy you adjust exactly like this so we select another new one exactly like this then we'll go to we crop it then check it should be 39 by 6 39 by 6 so this is the so let's look at this this is sex so we use our same thing exactly like this we we'll position it like this so we use our relative position to make sure that they are aligned to the center. So after we are able to do this, after we are able to do this, we we'll now give it our own desired color. So the color I'm going to use is this. Then I'm going to use uh, this color as well. So as you can see. So after I'm able to do that, then I will go to my gallery. I'll go to the gallery, go to the load, then I will have this. Then so actually change this. Let's change the color. Let me manipulate the color so that uh, this can be able to fit in. So after giving it the same color, then we we'll adjust like this. So as you can see, so after we're able to do that, the next thing that we're going to do 
or let him make it like this. Let the edge or let it be like this. So you can see. Or let him make it fit in first. Uh -huh. Exactly. So after that, we will now lock everything. Let it lock everything. Then we we'll go with our right up. Our right up. So we have a champion, champion, then the phone that we are going to use, I want to use as center press. So after you download it, it will not show the full name, it will show in form of asset. So as center press, then you stretch it like this. Let it be bigger. This one will give us an avenue. So we have to go and uh, match everything. So unlock and mark everything. Unlock and match them. You can see. Then you reduce the size like this. Now use your relative position. Position this here. Then after that, the next thing you are going to do is to give this a little space. So use your relative position. Then we copy and edit. Then we write the full name of everything. City community. City community. Chapel. City community chapel. So as you can see, then we we'll go to size and reduce to minimal level so that it will fit in here. So you can see we can increase, increase. So it's actually okay. Then we we'll make it like this. So after that, the next thing is to increase. Let's increase this a little bit. Let increase. Use your relative position as I said to make sure that it's positioned to the center. Increase the remaining name as well. So after that, give it different color. I will maintain this. Then come here and maintain this. And this is just as simple as this. So it's just as simple as this. It's just as simple as this. And this is just the way. The ways you can make a simple just fly. The teacher of this represent particular represent mini. It has a mini. So including the bell icon you see the sword. The bed icon still represent something so after that we say we transferring background because we want to present it on a markup so we save so as i said let's just present the design on a markup now come to your uh this is a photo p website then as you can see we have new project open from computer and psd templates click on play psd templates option will pop up so among those options there will be a kind of uh, category under the category we have mock-up and others click on the mock-ups then we will wait for it to load so after loading these are the things under the mock-ups then we are going to use this particular mock-up called 3d glass mock-up then you click on it for final clicking after you click on that then it will load the mock-up for us to be able to edit it and in this area whether you're a newbie or you are good at it at using uh, this particular website so you don't need to extract any more code thinking of and whenever you make your own design just come here directly and follow this normal process then at the long run you will bring your import your mock-up i mean your design so after this come to the layer you see where i tap then you see your logo double tap it like this then another layer pop up and hide all that thing when you see this inspiring b that is design in it that design hide it and click on layer this is an empty layer now let's go to file click on open and place click on import and bring the design we make on our uh, uh photo pin i mean on our piece of lab now so click on it import it like this and wait so after you download it click on file and click on 
save with smart object so at this level at this juncture you need to go wait and look at the, the screen of the phone for the uh, mock-up to transform your design so after it's been done then we are not just transforming our logo alone here i'm going to teach you how you can do a kind of effect as well so we we'll wait for it to transform so after it transformed then we can proceed with other things it's no magic so it is running on the ground then you see the result so after seeing this result the next thing to do is to do some crazy things click on the layer then go to the backlight and off it go to the effect and off it then the next thing to do is to click on this layer after clicking on this layer the next thing that we're going to do is to click on this the effect at the bottom then there is one icon that follow the effect click on it it will bring this color fill go to the color fill then select this select this click ok are you getting it then the next thing you will do is to go to opacity reduce opacity to 30 or let's say 25 opacity to 25 then color fill as well to be 25 you get in then you click ok can you see so this is what we're going to do so after that the next thing that we are going to do right now is to still adjust a little bit this is uh, the same thing let uh let me make this to be 20 our opacity and check is still to blend let go to color fill to be 20 as well and click ok and check it's still okay little way blending then uh, let's go to this uh, effect let's reduce it to be 50 50 then let's go to this and make it to be 50 by 50 as well let me make it to be 50 by 50 click ok then we check everything is cool we're getting it then let the opacity here to be 100 let's be 100 and check as you are doing it just be checking let the fill to be 20 and C. let's look at it no let me make it to be 100 back 100 okay cool then let's go to up this one opacity is 29 let me make it to be 15 okay cool cool so you can see then let's go to under this let's go to opacity and make it to be 50 color fill to be 60 and see the results yeah very cool very cool very cool so let's go to our main color and reduce the opacity to 15 15 color fill to be 15 as well then mark and let's check so this is cool so now go to the file go to export as go to png to save so under five minutes or six minutes we are just done so and let's look at the result so you can see so the background everything is being customized it's not as what as bad as that so can you see very very clean this is just a way and what i did was i'm just applying all those effects reducing this what's the color and everything and the light is still show there but i don't allow it to be too much so can you see so this is just simple for now you can make a present your logo on the marker very very simple thank you for watching god bless you